bright white lights, too much screen time, and tiny fonts are all to blame for poor eyesight, according to a new study from National Taiwan University Hospital. They found that lamps with a warmer light can help protect your eyes. Researchers from National Tsinghua University joined NTU doctors in the study, along with the help from Shu Guang Girls Senior High School. A young person picks up their phone and stares at the screen. Once you start scrolling, you might not stop for hours. Exhausted eyes can easily be the result. I'm using my phone almost all the time when I'm not sleeping. I'm looking at it even during meals. I think everyone's life is like that. Reading under a strong light will exhaust your eyes, firstly, and secondly, it will cause enormous harm to our macula lutea. Companies have launched anti-blue light stickers for glasses, even fooling customers with ultraviolet light pens, which are similar to blue light. But testing by professional equipment reveals a surfeit of shoddy goods. Among the seven anti-blue light stickers we tested, the most effective only increased the length of safe screen time 15 percent. But phones are not the only dangers to our eyes. The characters in this textbook are large, but the Bopomofo pronunciation guide is tiny. Experts say that while children are learning to read characters, the blue light from lamps is just the start of their trouble. Straining to read tiny Bopomofo marks is a major cause of childhood short-sightedness. The text is close to your eyes, the characters are small, the light is bright, short-sightedness, and then serious eye diseases. If you're using candlelight, you just need the light to be a bit gentler and not too bright. Then we can see more clearly. This eye doctor recommends using a bulb with a yellow candlelight color to read. On your phone, choose the blue light filter setting or the dark theme wherever possible. That will protect your eyes from staring at white for hours on end.